friends welcome back today we will see what are the various object oriented programming languages object oriented programming is a programming paradigm that follows the concept of objects what is an object object is an instance of class or you can say a real world entity say a human being a cat a dog or a fish what we see physically in this world the objects incorporate data in the form of fields attributes or properties and then the code is given in the format of procedures or sometimes called as methods so procedures or methods define the behavior of the objects and the data fields define the uh, the properties of the objects so this concept is called as object oriented concept and the programming languages that follow this concept or that follow the object oriented paradigm are java c++ c# hash, perl r kotlin dart uh, javascript uh, object pascal objective c uh, simula scala all these are some of the examples of object oriented programming languages widely used object oriented programming languages are c++ java python and the first programming language which is defined as object oriented is simula which is developed around 1965 the object oriented programming programs that programming languages that i have listed right now uh fall into two categories of one being pure object oriented programming languages and the other being semi object oriented programming language based on the degree of object oriented qualities that they possess now let us look into what are the various object oriented qualities that a programming language should possess the first one is encapsulation or data hiding the second is polymorphism the third is inheritance the fourth is abstraction the fifth is all predefined types should be objects the sixth one is all user defined types should be object the seventh quality is all operations are performed by passing messages to the objects now java is not pure object oriented programming language because of two reasons the first is everything in java is not objects because the primitive data types like int float char all these are not objects the second reason is because of the static keyword the static methods can be accessed directly without an object so that is the reason java violates the seventh quality so which is making java not a pure object oriented programming language examples of pure or complete or fully object oriented programming languages are smalltalk scala and ruby hope this video is helpful to you my friends please watch my upcoming videos stay home stay safe happy learning bye